Good evening, I'm Shamika Neely. Speaker of the House Brian Bosma says Indianapolis Representative Phil Hinkle should resign his seat amid accusations he initiated a sexual encounter with a young man at an Indianapolis hotel. Bosma already has begun removing the six-term Republican from committee leadership posts. Hinkle released a statement saying he is seeking professional help on what he, on what turned him down a road of self-destruction. He says he will not run for the re-election in 2012, a decision he says was made last December, but he made no indication he will resign. Bosma says the House Republican leadership met last week and privately urged Hinkle to step down after the most recent statement from the embattled legislator. Bosma felt obligated to publicly call for Hinkle's resignation. Students moving into the apartment building where missing IU student Lauren Spear lived at the time of her disappearance say they're aware of the search for her. WTIU's Gretchen Frazee reports. Students are beginning to move their belongings back into Smallwood Apartments in Bloomington, where Lawrence Spear lived before she went missing this past June. Many of the students were not in town over the summer, but they say the incident is on their minds. We talked about it more during like the summertime, but like we've still been like talking about it. And I know like my roommate and I are going to go to like a safety awareness seminar like later today. Other female students say they will take extra precautions when they go out this year. I'm not too worried about it, although I do feel really bad about the situation, and I think everyone should be careful. Yeah, again, I'm not really worried. I don't think the campus has changed. I was here last year, and everything was fine, although we never go out alone. We always use the buddy system. We're roommates, and we stick together. One mother said her son won't let a girl walk home alone. Spears' parents have put up new signs throughout the city this week in hopes students might provide information on their daughter's whereabouts. For WTIU, I'm Gretchen Frazee. A look at your weather tonight, cloudy, 30% chance of rain.